What is up guys, Shadow Gale back up in here with a another episode of... Actually, no, I don't like that. I'm gonna restart that one. That one sucks. <laughs> cut that one out, cut that one out, cut that one out. Alright, let me try that again. Hold on. What is up guys, Shadow Gale back up in here with a little bit of information about what I'm gonna be planning to do. Uh, so, this is a little bit of an information on the Xyz Cup that's gonna be happening tomorrow. I am actually gonna be playing on streaming during that because I want to try and climb all the way as far as I can uh, to the top. I want to get there as far as I can and I want to talk a little bit about what I'm going to be playing and a little bit about what you guys and I am going to probably be expecting is going to show up a lot of. So uh, right here um, I'm very down low on this but either way the deck I'm planning on starting out with is going to be Fire King Kashtira. It's it's a work in progress for the most part, okay? It's definitely a work in progress, but it's essentially just the normal Fire King, pure Fire King, mind you, with a little splash of the Kashtira engine inside of it. Uh, this is only good, really, if I'm going first or going second and I have at least one of them in hand, uh, especially the Unicorn. It's one of the most eff effective ways to get rid of uh, your opponent's Xyz cards, uh, specifically the troublesome ones like Zeus, Typhon, or anything on those along those lines but uh this is more of a fire king deck and i have practiced a little bit with it fire king's really strong even without the snake guys which for whatever reason they decided that it was totally fine to keep pretty much the entire snake guy engine which i thought about using but without the but without link monsters it makes it a lot harder to use this deck so anybody could actually run snake guys with it either way uh, a lot of other decks have also not really been hit. So for instance, Labyrinth. Labyrinth has not been hit pretty much at all. So people are gonna, there's gonna definitely be Labyrinth decks out there. Uh, the same thing which I noticed this, like this is one of the first things I noticed, but Eldritch has also not been touched whatsoever. Which is interesting to me because usually in these styles of uh, tournaments and you know, festivals and such, Usually you tend to see like these specific decks getting hit, especially the trap decks. One more thing I want to make mention, uh, Skill Drain is at one. Same with Rivalry, Gozen, and Tikaboo. So, uh, there can only be one. These cards are still legal, so I'm curious why that is the case. Uh, probably they want to see how well it all functions. Uh, either way, uh, a, f a few of the other decks probably they're going to be more aware of. Uh, besides, you know, the trap decks, we have the actual Xyz decks that people are going to be watching out for, especially on the lines of, you guessed it, Purely. Purely is pretty much full power minus, you know, the obvious uh, limitations on it, but it's a full powered deck. Like, this deck is specifically going to be in this tournament, and it's going to be insanely powerful. Uh, it's going to be hard to actually win against such a deck. And I can only hope that we'll actually have enough engine to hopefully outlast them, because how uh, Fire King works, a lot of resources. Uh, but besides purely, we're also going to be probably dealing with a lot of the Exo Sisters. Obviously, very strong deck, still a very viable deck even in with today's meta, especially with anything that uses the graveyard. Uh, and with Fire King, I know this is going to be a deck I'm going to be fearing to have to fight. But that's also why we try and get the Unicorn. Uh, banish away any of their specific monsters, you know what I'm saying? Uh, let me think here. Uh, besides Exosister Purely, the different trap decks, and some other problem cards, uh, Cash Tira on its own is still going to be a very viable deck. I thought about putting in more of a Cash Tira engine, but I thought, nah, I might as well just try and focus on the actual Fire King, because most people are not going to be expecting the Fire Kings. Uh, at least in my mind, even though we lit there's literally a Fire King Xyz monster. But that's why I wanted to play Fire King, because people are probably not going to be expecting it. Uh, I also know this, that a lot of people are probably going to be playing the Horus engine. Horus is just really strong. Uh, it's probably one of the more efficient ways, using King Sarcophagus to out a lot of, uh, a lot of the... Uh, bigger monsters, uh, especially when their attack gets a lot higher. Uh, so that's why... In a way, we're also playing uh, our own uh, rank 8 engine, which Horus is definitely going to be playing. Uh, we're playing it using Kirin and the Grunix, so we can literally get out any of the different, uh, you know, the, the, the different 8 rank Xyz monsters. Either way, that's what I'm going to be doing. Just letting y'all know, I'm going to be doing a stream tomorrow, focusing on getting through 
and getting to the top as much as I can of the uh, Xyz Festival. So I hope you guys, I hope to see some of you guys there at least. Obviously my deck could be better. I mean, it could definitely be improved or changed or adjusted, uh, but I plan to focus on mostly uh, using this deck tomorrow. And if I throw in some other things or change up decks, I probably will. Either way, I hope you guys, I hope to see you guys. I hope you all are having a good day. Uh, and yeah, it's going to be a blast tomorrow. Either way, hope you guys take care. And yeah, take care.